it's me, Allie. Welcome back to my channel. I hope they're all having a great start to your day. I'm here today to do my Pop Sugar Must Have Unboxing for October 2015. For those of you unfamiliar with Pop Sugar, I will link all the information in the description below, along with a playlist of some previous unboxings if you want to get a true idea of what Pop Sugar is all about. And as always, if you have any other questions or concerns, just ask them in the comments below, and I'll be sure to answer them back as soon as possible. We're gonna move right into this unboxing. The first thing I'm putting out of the box for this month is Sappy Sleepers 100% Satin Pillowcases. Welcome to the slumber party. Me, your new White Russian 100% Pure Satin Pillowcase. Our soothing hand blend of satin is recommended by top hair stylists and dermatologists. Sleep better tonight. So apparently this satin pillowcase is beneficial to your skin and to your hair. I don't really know if that's true, but it sounds really nice. To be honest with you, I feel like a lot of people are going to be disappointed that they're getting a pillowcase in their box this month. I'm actually really excited about this. Quick little story time, a little over a month ago, Adam just got his wisdom teeth out and he ended up staying over my house after the procedure and he ended up bleeding onto the pillow. So he ended up calling me at work and said that he bought two new pillows. My pillowcase wasn't affected, so my pillowcase is on my pillow. And then on the pillow that he uses, it's just a pillow right now, there's no case on it. So I'm pretty pumped that I'm getting a pillowcase to put on it. I wish that I was getting a set of two so that it would match, but I'm really not gonna complain. I'm just happy that I don't have to go out and spend money on it. We're off to a really great start, and the next thing I'm pulling out are these fuzzy socks. They're so fuzzy and they're so soft, and they seem like they're going to be extremely comfortable. You can never go wrong with fuzzy socks. You also can never have enough fuzzy socks. So kudos to you, Pop Sugar, for putting these into the box. They are pink, and I can only assume that because they're pink, maybe this is an item that the proceeds go towards breast cancer, or there's something to represent breast cancer and the fight to stop it. So I will check that in the little booklet, but I'm gonna assume that because they're pink and because it's October, this has something to do with Breast Cancer Awareness Month, but let's just talk about how fuzzy and how soft and how comfy these are going to be. Up next is the food item of the month, and it is the Belgian Boys Stroop Waffles. This is an authentic Dutch caramel waffle, and they are giving us two waffles in here. I've actually tried these before. I believe Love With Food sent us these before, and they are amazing. I'm not gonna taste test them because they're really interesting. What you're supposed to do is have like a cup of tea, or a cup of coffee, or a cup of hot chocolate, whatever. You're supposed to have a hot beverage, and then you place this little Stroop waffle right on top of the beverage, and then the steam from the beverage ends up heating this up and makes the caramel really gooey inside and just makes the waffle really warm and really fluffy. So again, I'm not gonna try these right now because they're not gonna taste as good cold, but I have had these before. I didn't have the caramel kind before. I forget which, which flavor I had, but they are really amazing. I really did enjoy them a lot. I could not be more excited about the next item. It is the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product. This used to be my go-to hair product for months upon months upon months. I actually think I even gave this away in one of my first giveaways because I really am a true believer in this product. It completely keeps your hair not damaged from the heat. It replenishes all your split ends, keeps your hair really, really shiny. I ran out of my product and then I got cheap and I never bought myself a new one. I wanna say this is like $13 at Ulta. I used to buy the bigger one, which is upwards of like $25. So like I said, when I ran out, I just got cheap. It's really expensive, but it truly does the trick. So I'm really, really excited to get this. It's just a tiny little guy. It even says sample on it. So I'm pretty sure you can buy these at Ulta, but I don't know, it says sample on it. So maybe you can't, maybe these are just like the ones that they give you if you spend like $75 and that's how I got my first one. But after I got this tiny little one from Ulta, I did end up buying the bigger one and then I just got cheap. So. Pretty pumped that I'm getting this in the box and I'll be able to use this for at least like a month and a half, two months. There are three things left in the box. I'm gonna save the best for last, but I have to say this is a pretty fantastic box so far. I just wanna reiterate that I buy Pop Sugar with my own money. Pop Sugar does not send me this box for reviewing purposes and all of the opinions that I give in this video and in all of my video are completely honest and completely 
mine. I know I had a lot of people in some of my previous videos going back and forth saying she always gives Pop Sugar such a positive review. It's probably because Pop Sugar is just sending her these boxes for reviewing purposes and she has to be positive. That is not now nor has that ever been the case. There have been plenty of boxes that I received from Pop Sugar and from other companies that I have not been very happy with and I voiced my opinion on it. So again, I just wanted to throw that out there that these are my true and honest opinions but I just, I really like Pop Sugar a lot and I believe that they knock their boxes out of the park each and every month. So that's why some of them are more positive than other. Anyways, moving on, the next thing that we are getting is Honest Sea Salt and Sugar. This is a body scrub and it's in the scent Lavender Vanilla. It's ultra hydrating, exfoliating, and it has a softening treatment. And it's by The Honest Company. It smells terrible. Just my personal opinion, it smells really, really bad. But I think it's a great item to have in the box, especially with these colder months up ahead. Your skin's gonna be getting a lot drier and I believe it's going to do the trick, but I cannot get down with that scent at all. I'll just end up using this in the shower where I don't really care so much about the scent because I'm just gonna wash it away. But no, it does not smell good. <laughs> I'm sorry. There are two things left in the box, and the second to last thing I'm pulling out is Easy Tiger. And these look like they are little wine bags, like traveling wine bags. And it looks like they have like little sayings on them. The first one says, eat, drink, and be amazing. The next one just has like an XXX on it. Then we have one that says, cheers and cheers, upside down. And then the last one we have is, best wine ever. I actually really like this idea. I think this is really smart of Pop Sugar to put this in the box because we are around in the holiday season and a lot of people are gonna be bringing wine to Thanksgiving or to Christmas parties or Christmas Eve or New Year's Eve. So this is just a fun little way to travel with your wine and to make more of a impact when you are giving it to that specific person or bringing it to that specific party. So I really like these a lot. And saving the best for last, the very last item in the October Pop Sugar Must Have Box for 2015 is the new Mindy Kaling book. This is Why Not Me. Her first book was hysterical, and this was actually the spoiler alert that Pop Sugar sent out for October. So once I found out that I was going to be getting this book, I did a little bit of research and I checked out some reviews. People who were reviewing this book said that if you like the first book, you're going to love the second one. It is even funnier and it is really well written. This book alone is $25, so just this book is already accounting for more than half of the price of the box. And then we got all that extra fun stuff as well. I really like the color of it. I love that it's hardcover. I love all the cute little details on the back. It has a picture of her heart, and it says her heart is made up of true love, fearless young woman, nice guys, handsome jerks. When you order a salad and they accidentally give you fries, light personal drama, subtweeting my enemies, etc. So she's just so funny and I really can't wait to read this and I think you all know how I feel about when Pop Sugar sends out books. I love it and they always end up being my favorite months. And that's it, that's everything that came in the box for October and I don't think I even need to say it, but I will. I really, really enjoyed this box. I think they had a really great theme that's going around and I really like how they incorporated items that we're gonna be using in the fall. But that's what I think. I would love to know what you guys think below. Did you like this box? Did you not like this box? Thumbs up if you like this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel and you enjoyed my videos, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. I would truly appreciate it. And as always, I just wanna take a minute to say thank you so much for all you do on my channel. Thank you for your love, thank you for your support, thank you for all your positivity that you send me on my channel. It truly means the world to me and I love signing on to YouTube to interact with all of you each and every day. I hope you're having a beautiful day and I hope you're having an even better week and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!